Hey, what is up guys? This is iReviews. In this video, I will show you the top 100 free iOS 9 Cydia tweaks. Safari Refresher. This tweak allows you to easily refresh a page on Safari. All you have to do is just pull down like this and as you can see now you can refresh that page. Tactful. This tweak will add 3D touch support for Cydia. You can see when I press the icon of Cydia here, I can refresh the repos, add a new repo, I have the recent installations right here, and I can go ahead and search anything on Cydia from here. Unlock Volume This tweak allows you to adjust the volume of your device even when your device is locked. As you can see right here, I can adjust the volume of my device directly from the lock screen. App Color Close Now when you go to move or delete an app on your springboard you will notice that all the X buttons have the same color but this tweak will change their color based on the color of the icon. Tap Tap Folder This tweak will add a very cool feature to your folders. Now normally when you tap a folder it will open that folder but if you double tap it with this tweak it will open the first app on that folder. CC Swipe allows you to quickly go to your app switcher without needing to double press the home button. All you have to do is just swipe like this and as you can see you can go to your app switcher without pressing your home button. Unicode Faces This tweak will add Unicode faces to the keyboard of your iOS 9 device. All you have to do is just tap and hold the spacebar and now you can see all these Unicode faces and you can add them anywhere you want. Double tap to sleep. This is a simple tweak. All it does is that it allows you to send your device to sleep simply by double tapping anywhere on the home screen. Flasharama. This tweak will enable the flash on pano shots. Now normally this won't have the flashlight but now with this tweak you can have the flashlight when you're shooting a panorama. Keyboard Vibrate 8. This tweak will add a nice vibration to the keys of your keyboard when you press them. You can see when I press the keys of my keyboard you can hear that little vibration and you can change the amount of vibration by going to the settings of this tweak. Lock Screen Tool. This tweak allows you to customize the lock screen of your device. As you can see right here I have no date. Also I have hidden the grabbers and also you can change the slide unlock text to any text you want and you can change their color and you can do also a lot of more customizations and you can do them by going to the settings of this tweak. Media Downloader allows you to download music, videos and also documents. When you install it you will get this icon on your springboard. When you open this icon you can google here anything you want. You have the downloads the files and also the audio player right here. Red Notification Grabber This tweak will make the notification center grabber red on your lock screen when you have petting notifications on your notification center. Replace Blur This tweak will replace the stock blur of iOS 9 with the slider blur as you can see it right here on the dock or on the folder right here. We have a lighter blur and you will also have it on your spotlight search. Enable Live Photos This tweak will bring the Live Photos feature from the iPhone 6s and the 6s Plus to older devices. You can see this button right here, all you have to do is just tap it and now when you take a picture, it will take a live picture. You can see here, now when I go to take a look at this picture, all I have to do is just tap it and as you can see, we have a live photo right there. This tweak doesn't have any options to configure. All you have to do is install it. Tinge. This tweak allows you to change the color of the switches and toggles on your device. As you can see right here, this orange toggle. And you can change that color to any color you like. Here you have some preset colors. And if you go back, here you have a custom color. You can change them to any color you like. Aurea LS. This tweak allows you to replace the clock on the lock screen with this cool looking clock. As you can see it right here, 
very nice and clean look now you can customize it by going to the settings then here you have Aurea LS, you go to clock face settings and then you go here, you can choose between three different clocks and you can also customize here the fonts, you can also enable 24 hour and also show AM and PM. Berry C8, this tweak allows you to open apps directly from your lock screen. All you have to do is just tap on an icon, drag it down here and it will open that app. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, then here you have the shortcuts, you can add up to 12 apps on your lock screen, just go here and pick any app you want. Now if you go back, then here you have the icon size, apps per page and also you can enable or disable badges on your lock screen. Reveal menu, this tweak will add the 3D touch feature to older iOS 9 devices. You can see right here, all I have to do is just tap and hold one of the icons and now it will give me options here, just like it does on 3D touch devices. You can see here, I don't have to lift my finger, just tap and then I, I can slide my finger like this, just release it and I can take a quick action directly from that menu. Better shut down. This tweak will give you some more options when you go to the power down menu of your device. You can see here you will have power off, reboot or respring. You can choose either one of these options from the shutdown menu. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can disable it on the lock screen. You can choose between two different themes and you can enable or disable safe mode. Face down. This tweak will send your device to sleep when you face it down somewhere on a table or anywhere just face it down and it will send your device to sleep faces this tweak allows you to customize the lock screen of your device by adding different images as the background of the passcode buttons you can see here you can add a different image for each of the passcode buttons on your lock screen now to do that you need to go to your settings go to faces, enable it, then here you have choose images, if you go here, you will have all the buttons, just click one of them and you can choose the background for that button. Cask, this tweak will add these nice animations when you scroll through lists, as you can see them right here. And if you go to the settings of this tweak here, you can choose between different styles, if you go here, you have five different styles, you can also change the duration right here. Alarm volume. This tweak allows you to set a custom volume for your alarms. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak, enable these two switches right here and then here you have the volume. You can also set a fade in, you can also enable this tweak for the timer and you can enable here vibrations for the alarms and for the timer. CC background. This tweak allows you to customize the background of your control center by adding any of your images as the background of your control center. To do that you need to go to your settings, go to CC background, enable it, then go here, select image and you can pick any of your images and set it as the background of your control center. Alkaline. This tweak allows you to customize the battery icon on the status bar of your device. If you go to the settings of this tweak, here you will have an enable button to enable or disable this tweak, then here you have theme. If you go here, you will have three different themes that you can choose from. Cylinder. This tweak will add these cool animations on your springboard when you slide through your pages on your springboard. Now if you go to settings and go to cylinder, here you will have effects. If you go here, you have a lot of effects you can choose from. You can also combine more than one effect and create your own formula. Alarm. This tweak allows you to easily turn on or off all the alarms that you have set on your device. You can see this toggle right here. You can easily go ahead and turn on or off all the alarms that you have set on your device. Color reachability. This tweak allows you to change the color on the reachability view. As you can see here we have a blue color and you can change it to any color you like. To do that you need to go to the settings of this tweak, enable it, then go to tint color and here you can pick any color you like. You can also set the blur amount right here. You can randomize or you can reset the color right here. Force color. This tweak will change the color of the blur when you use 3D touch 
on your device based on the color of the icon. You can see right here if I use it on the mail app the blur will be blue but if I use it on iBooks you can see right here the blur will be orange. Date in status bar. This tweak allows you to add the current date on the status bar of your device. You can see right here on the left side you will have the date while on the right side you will have the clock. Shift cycle. This is a very useful tweak which allows you to select the text and then you can just press the shift key and as you can see you can change all the text, you can set all the text on uppercase or tap once again and you can change the complete text in lowercase. Hide settings search. This is a simple tweak, all it does is that it will hide the search bar from the settings app. If you don't need it or you don't use it, you can hide it using this tweak. Icon renamer. This tweak allows you to rename any of the icons on your device. All you have to do is just tap and hold one of the icons and now just tap one of them and as you can see you can rename it right here. Icon bounce. This tweak will add these nice animations to the icons of your dock on your iOS 9 device. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, here you can enable it, you have different animations right here, you can disable or enable any of these animations and if you go back then you have here the bounce interval and also you have the animation duration and you can set them with these sliders right here. Delete forever. This tweak allows you to easily delete pictures permanently from your device so that you don't have to go to the recently deleted folder and delete them once again. All you have to do is just tap here and this picture will be deleted from the device and you won't see it on the recently deleted album. Double cut. This tweak allows you to enter your email anywhere you want simply by double tapping a key on your keyboard. Now you can see right here I'm using the add key, double tap on that and as you can see it will enter my email. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you can set which key you want to use, you just go here, enter the key and then enter your email right here and click save. Elm Poem. This tweak will add more options to your device when you take a screenshot. You can see right here if I take a screenshot on my device, it will ask me if I want to save it to photo library, copy it, upload it or I can go ahead and share this screenshot directly from here. Easy low power mode. This tweak allows you to quickly enable or disable the low power mode. All you have to do is go to settings and enable the switch right here. You don't need to go to settings then go to battery and then go to enable low power mode. All you have to do is just go set to settings and enable the switch right here. Easy respring. This is a simple but useful tweak which allows you to easily respring your device directly from the app switcher. All you have to do is just push up the home card and it will respring your device. Folder 6 Plus. This tweak will add some very cool features to the folders on your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here it will add a 4x4 layout to your folders and also it will allow you to create nested folders which means that you can create a new folder inside of a folder. Always more for Spotlight. Now notice when you go to your Spotlight you will have only one row of suggestions, apps or contacts or anything it is and this tweak does just that, it will show you always two rows of suggestions of apps or contacts. Battery icon. This tweak will add this battery icon on the springboard of your device and when you tap it, it will take you directly to the battery settings on your settings app and notice this battery icon is live so it will change depending on the percentage of battery that you have on your device. Battery life. This tweak will give you detailed information about the battery life of your device. When you install it you will get this icon on your home screen you tap it and here will have all the detailed information about the life of your battery. Brad Crumbs Away allows you to easily dismiss the back to app link on iOS 9. All you have to do is just swipe it like this and as you can see it will remove it and now you will see your signal. CC Loader. This tweak allows you to customize the control center 
of your device by enabling or disabling any of these sections of the control center. Now, if you go to the settings of this tweak, you can enable or disable any of these sections. You can also rearrange them any way you like. Grabber time. This tweak will display the time and also the battery indicator here on the notification center grabber. So when you're on full screen, all you have to do is just show the grabber and you can see the time right here. Sleek code. This tweak allows you to customize the passcode screen of your iOS 9 device. You can see here how cool it looks. You have no circles here around the buttons. It looks very nice. And if you go to the settings of this tweak, here you have passcode settings. If you go here, you can enable blur. You can also disable the button rings, button animations. You can also hide the emergency button. And if you go back here, you have a respring button for all the changes to take effect. CC Matters. This tweak will add some very useful information to the control center of your device. Here we'll have the percentage of usage of your CPU. Here you have your free RAM memory. Here you have your free space on your device. And then here you have the data, the upload and the download. CC Now Playing. This tweak allows you to easily share what you're listening to to your social media. As you can see right here, you have a Twitter and a Facebook icon. All you have to do is just tap that and you can quickly share this to your social media. Circle icons. This tweak will make all the icons in the settings app circles. As you can see right here, all the icons are in circles. Very cool tweak. It doesn't have any options to configure. System Aperio. This is a simple tweak. All it does is that it will blur out this part right here. When you open your control center, as you can see, it will blur out all this part right here and it looks pretty cool. Color Font 2. Now, have you noticed on iOS, the font will be white or black based on the color of the wallpaper. Now, what this tweak does is that it allows you to choose whichever color you want, no matter what wallpaper you have, you just go to your settings and pick any color of the font you want. Custom notification sounds. This tweak allows you to set custom sounds for the notifications of third party apps. If you go here to an app on the notification sections on the settings app, here you have custom sound. If you go here, you can enable sound and also here you can choose a custom sound for the notifications of this app. Advanced Settings 8. This tweak allows you to have access to hidden settings of your device. Now to do that, all you have to do is just tap and hold the settings icon. As you can see right here, this page will pop up and here you'll have all the hidden settings of your device. Now if you change any of these settings and you want to return them to their default, you will have this button right here. Just tap here and it will restore all the default settings. Unlock sound. This tweak will bring back the unlock sound to your iOS 9 device. As you can hear right here, the unlock sound will be back on your iOS 9 device. And if you go to the settings of this tweak, you can enable it right here. Then you can set a custom sound right here. You have all different sounds that you can choose from. Album shot. This tweak will create a separate folder for each of the apps where you take a screenshot. You can see right here, I have calculator. I did take a screenshot on the calculator app and now it will place it on the calculator album on the photo library. 4C, this tweak will bring the 3D touch feature to older iOS devices. You can see right here, if I swipe up on the icon of the camera here, it will show me the same options as it shows on 3D touch devices. You can see if I tap here, I can go ahead and quickly record a video directly from here. Fuse. Now, whenever you're playing music on your lock screen, normally you will have just the media controls up here and you won't have the clock or the date. Now, what this tweak does is that it will add the clock and the date up here and you will have the media controls down here on the lock screen. Glow Badge. This tweak will replace the normal badges with a glow around the icons, as you can see right here on the Cydia app. Now, if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, you can enable it in folders, then here you have the glow color, you can pick any color you like, then here you have show badge 4, you have no apps, only folders, 
aptly in list you can pick which apps you want or all the apps glow board this tweak will add a glow around the icons which are running in the background or which have petting notifications like facebook does right here you can also here see on the dock it will show a dot on the icons which are running in the background now if you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable here display on dock display on folder and also display in app switcher here you can set different animations for the glow and right here you can change the colors of the glow grabber app 8 this tweak allows you to add a second grabber on the lock screen of your device here you can see i have cydia and i can go ahead and open cydia directly from here it also allows you to change the camera grabber to any other app that you want i widgets this tweak allows you to add widgets to the home screen of your device all you have to do is just tap and hold and you can see this page right here and you can add a widget just click add right here and you can add it to your home screen you can tap and move it anywhere you want and if you want to install more widgets all you have to do is just go to Cydia and search for iWidgets lock light this tweak allows you to use the same gesture that you use to open the spotlight search to lock your device but the first thing you need to do after you install it is go to your settings and enable these two switches right here and now you can see when I pull down it will lock my device Munity. this tweak allows you to easily mute conversations from the messages list all you have to do is just swipe on a conversation and you can mute it directly from here photo size this tweak will show you the size of your photos when you select them here you can see when i select one picture it will show this size right here and when i select more it will show the size of all these pictures right here placeholder this tweak will add an icon to all the tweaks on the settings app that don't have their icon you can see right here this tweak low power mode didn't have an icon at all and this tweak will add an icon to each of the tweaks that don't have one portrait lock this tweak allows you to enable portrait lock when you open certain apps if you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable it right here then if you go to portrait you can choose in which apps you want to enable portrait lock when you open that app here i have the calculator and as you can see when i open the calculator it will enable the portrait lock record and torch this tweak allows you to turn on and off the flashlight while you're recording a video you can see here i'm recording a video and I can turn on the flash when I need it and then I can turn it off turn it back on and off anytime I want while I'm still recording a video record pause this tweak allows you to pause while you're recording and then continue recording again you can see right here if I tap to record I can tap here at the clock and it will stop it will pause and now I can still continue just tap again there tap once more to pause once more to continue very useful tweak repair settings layout this tweak will fix a bug on ios 9 when you open the settings app normally you will see the settings app something like this you won't see it this way so that you can see the search bar and everything but it will be something like this but with this tweak when you open the settings app it will be normal you can see here the search bar and everything insta tools this tweak will add some very useful features to the instagram app on your ios 9 device as you can see right here two more buttons one is to save pictures to the camera roll and one to share them you can also tap and hold a picture and you can zoom in and out on that picture last app this tweak allows you to easily move between your two last apps you can see right here if i open calculator and then i go ahead and open safari i can double tap here on the status bar and it will take me to, to the calculator double tap again it will take me to safari double tap again you can see how it will it will switch between two last apps now after you install this tweak you need to go to settings go to activator and here you will set a gesture which you will use to switch between your two last apps minimal hood this tweak will replace your stock volume hood 
with this very cool volume hood as you can see it right here on the side of the device it looks very cool and it won't interrupt you anything on your screen now if you go to the settings of this tweak you have an enable button then here you can choose between four different themes and also you can change its position right here nc date customizer this tweak allows you to customize the date on the notification sender as you can see right here you can place all the text in one row you can also change its color now if you go to the settings of this tweak here you have all the options with which you can customize the date on your notification sender no page dots 7 this tweak will remove the page dots from the home screen of your device as you can see right here you will have a nice clean look without the page dots no slow animations this tweak will disable all the slow animations from your iOS 9 device. You can see when I open and close this folder, the animation is pretty quick. Also when I open apps and here on the settings of this tweak you can enable it and here you can also set the speed of the animations. Reveal NC9. This is a simple tweak, all it does is that it will add this nice Android animation to the notification sender when you slide it down or up as you can see this cool animation it doesn't have any options to configure roman passcode this tweak will customize the passcode screen on your device you can see on the passcode screen you won't have the normal numbers but you will have roman numbers instead of the normal numbers this tweak doesn't have any options to configure round dock this tweak will add these rounded corners to the dock of your device as you can see right here both of the corners of the dock are rounded and it looks pretty cool safari tab count this is a simple tweak which will count how many tabs you have open in safari you can see right here i have two you can see if i open another one here three very useful tweak very simple it doesn't have any options to configure same status have you ever noticed the status bar on the lock screen it's bigger than it is on the home screen now this is what this tweak does it will keep the status bar on the lock screen and on the home screen at the same size save gram this tweak allows you to save pictures from instagram it's pretty easy to use all you have to do is just tap the dots right here and as you can see you will have a save option here to save this picture to your camera roll SB icon alpha this tweak allows you to change the transparency of the icons on your springboard you can see right here the calculator and also the app store icons are more transparent than the other icons and you can do that by going to settings here you have SB icon alpha and here you can set the transparency then go here and choose to which icons you want to apply this tweak SB power alert this tweak allows you to set an activator gesture and use that gesture to show up a page with different options you can see if i double tap the status bar it will show me sb power alert and here i have some informations about my device and then i can also go ahead and reboot it power it up respring it or send my device to the safe mode share pro this tweak will add this floating button on your home screen which you can move anywhere you like and it allows you to quickly share from anywhere on your home screen you just tap this button and here it will give you options to share to your social media and if you tap and hold this button then it will give you some other options here you can shut down restart respring or send to safe mode your device speed intensifier this tweak will speed up the animations of your ios 9 device as you can see here when i open and close this folder the animation is pretty quick also when you open apps you will have faster animations and if you go to the settings of this tweak you can enable it right here then here you can set the speed of the animations spotlight be gone this tweak allows you to disable the spotlight from your home screen you can also disable this search page that you have on the left side of your home screen now to do that you need to go to your settings go to spotlight be gone and here you have two toggles where you can enable or disable the spotlight on your device spot white this tweak will add this nice lighter blur to the spotlight search on your device you can see when you go to your spotlight 
the blur will be a little lighter, it looks very cool, this tweak doesn't have any options to configure. Status bar color, this tweak allows you to customize the color of the status bar on your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here the status bar of my device has a blue color and you can pick a different color for the status bar on your lock screen and a different color for the status bar on your home screen. Status bar timer, whenever you start the stopwatch or the timer on your clock app you will see the timer right here on the status bar right next to the clock. A very useful tweak, it doesn't have any options to configure, all you have to do is install it. Status Hood 2. This tweak will replace your stock volume hood and will place the volume hood here on the status bar. As you can see, when I change the volume of my device, you can see here the hood will be placed on the status bar. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, you have an enable button, then here you have style, you can choose between two different styles and also you can change its size right here. Swipe for more. This tweak allows you to easily install and uninstall tweaks from Cydia. All you have to do is just swipe here on a tweak and you can install it or if you already have it installed, you can uninstall it just like that. Swipe home. This tweak allows you to easily close all the background running apps simply by swiping up the home card on the app switcher and as you can see right here, no apps running in the background. Swipe selection. This tweak allows you to easily move the cursor anywhere on the text simply by swiping your finger through the keyboard. You can also select text by swiping your finger from the shift key or from the delete key. You can see right here, just slide like this and it will easily select any text you want. Switcher badges. This tweak will show badges on the icons in the app switcher. As you can see right here, I have a badge on Cydia and it will show it on the app switcher. This is a simple tweak, it doesn't have any options to configure. Blord. This tweak will change the look of the keyboard on your iOS 9 device. As you can see right here, you will have a dark keyboard instead of the stock white keyboard that you get on your iOS 9 device. Now if you go to the settings of this tweak, all you have here is an enable button to enable or disable this tweak. Switcher Flipper. This is a simple tweak, all it does is that it will flip this side of the scroll on the card view on your app switcher. Time until alarm. This tweak will show you the time that you have left until your alarm goes off. You can see right here you will have the hours and the minutes right beside the alarm that you have set. Universal Mute. This tweak will mute both the ringer and the media volume when you turn on the mute switch on your device. As you can see right here, it will mute both the ringer and the media volume. So these are the top 100 free CD tweaks compatible with iOS 9. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. For more iOS 9 jailbreak videos, please make sure you subscribe. Also go ahead and follow me on Twitter. You can find a link to my Twitter account in the description of this video.